Hallelujah. Good morning. Welcome to the Pray Mom with PT. It's a prayer session designed specifically to pray for your children. You want to lift up your voices with me this morning and begin to give him praise, begin to give him glory. Sweet Holy Spirit, pray through us this morning as praying moms, as we pray for our children, pray for every member of our family. In the name of Jesus, let the Spirit of God pray through us, empower us to be able to pray this morning. In the name of Jesus, Father, we thank you. Thank you for every member of my family. Thank you, Jesus. I give you praise. Thank you for your words, O God, in accordance to your word in the book of Acts chapter 33 verse 25 thank you father because my seed oh god are blessed thank you my children my grandchildren they will be blessed in the name of jesus thank you because the word of salvation has been sent to my family this morning in accordance to your word in the book of acts chapter 13 verse 26 come on bless the name of god this morning salvation comes into your household this morning healing and deliverance in the name of Jesus. Deliverance from every form of depression in my household this morning. In the name of Jesus, no member of my household is permitted to be depressed. No member of my household is permitted to be stressed. To be stressed In the name of Jesus, salvation visits my home this morning. In the name of Jesus, healing in the name of Jesus. No member of my family is permitted to be sick. In the name of Jesus, I declare healing. Healing emotionally, healing physically. In the name of Jesus, Father, I thank you for your reign of blessings upon my children and my grandchildren this morning. I give you praise, O God. Thank you, Lord, because it is well with our soul this morning. In the name of Jesus, thank you, Lord. We'll worship you. As a family, Jehovah, this morning, we'll worship you. As a family, Jehovah, this morning, I pray that my children long and yearn to serve you. They long and yearn to worship you. In the name of Jesus, in truth and in spirit. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. We have been praying using the letters A to Z. This morning, we are going to continue with the letter C. And this morning, by the Spirit of God, I've titled C, Competence. Competence is the ability to do something successfully. We want to pray that our children and our grandchildren will be competent in the name of Jesus. Competence is the ability to be fed to, to effectively accomplish their goals. We want to pray with me this morning that my children, my grandchildren, we we, we effectively accomplish their God-given goals in the name of Jesus. Father, I pray, oh God, help my children and my grandchildren to be competent in the name of Jesus. Let them have competence in their career. Let them have competence in their job. In the name of Jesus, I pray this morning that the competence of my children in whatever they do will be unquestionable. Pray with me this morning. And it's not just competence in, in, in academics alone, but competence in every area of their life. In the name of Jesus, anything that my children find themselves doing, I pray, oh God, in accordance to your will. Father, I pray, give them the spirit of confidence, the spirit of competence. In the name of Jesus, let them put their trust in you. They are confident in you. In the name of Jesus. Bible says in the book of First John chapter 5 verse 14, this is the confidence which we have in him, that if we ask anything in his name, Bible says he will hear us. You want to lift up your voices and begin to pray that in the name of Jesus, I pray that my children, oh God, will always call upon God in the name of Jesus, in everything that they do to be able to build up their competence in the name of Jesus. Pray with me this morning. Resha tua tuta liga, let my children and my grandchildren grow in confidence, O oh God, in God. In the name of Jesus, let them believe God. Let it boost their competence. In the name of Jesus, 
pray with me this morning resha tolika do satutaliande rekebisa kukaliga psalm 118 verse 8 bible says it is better to trust in the lord than to put your confidence in man come on pray let my children and my grandchildren put their confidence in god in the name of jesus the god that is able to boost their competence in the name of jesus pray with me this morning resha tua tu lekebisa tutaliga rekeboso tolika do satutaliande Lord, help my children to develop a feeling of competence, O God, in the name of Jesus, to give them opportunities, O God, to improve their skills, in the name of Jesus. Pray with me. Masha kukaliga du satuta liga rakabo shatuta liga. Let my children, oh God, always look for opportunities, oh God, that we enhance, oh God, their confidence and oh God, and give them competence in the name of Jesus. Pray with me this morning. Resha tolika du satuta liande. Proverbs chapter twenty, Proverbs chapter three, verse twenty-six. Bible says, "For the Lord will be your confidence and will keep you, will keep your food from being cut." Come on, pray. Jehovah be the confidence of my children in the name of Jesus Russia tutaliga rusa tutaliande Philippians chapter 4 verse 13 I can do all things to Christ who strengthens me you want to pray with me this morning Lord help my children oh God to have that to, to have that confidence in you oh God that they can do all things oh God that their competence will be will be boosted in the name of Jesus pray with me this morning resa shatutali rakabisa to Taliande I pray that my children will have confidence, oh God, in the leadership role of, of, of Jehovah. In the name of Jesus, they will have confidence in their own leadership role. In the name of Jesus, in their friendship, their spiritual life. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. Resha tutalika, rekebisa tutaliande, rakaboshe kukaliga, ratusa tutaliande, boshe keke boso toriande. I declare my children will feel capable. In the name of Jesus, they will be powerful. Their trust will be in God. In the name of Jesus, resatoli lekibazu rakabi basu tariande resha tutaliga. Pray with me this morning. Resha tutaliga du se tutaliande. D D is for discipline. You want to pray that your children will be disciplined, disciplined in mind. In the name of Jesus, pray with me. Rasa tua shutaliga. Second Timothy chapter one verse seventeen verse seven. Bible Bible says that for the spirit, for the spirit God gave us is not that of timid, but it gives us the power, love, and self-discipline. Come on, pray that my children will be self-disciplined. In the name of Jesus, I declare that my grandchildren will be self-disciplined. D this morning is for discipline. Pray with me. Resa tolika du setutaliande. Lord, I bring my daughter, I bring my son to the altar of prayer this morning. I come against the spirit of timidity in the name of Jesus. Father, I pray that my children will be disciplined in the name of Jesus. They will have self-control in the name of Jesus. Pray with me this morning. Resha tolika, rakabusa kukaliande. Masha kukaliga do satuta liande rekebo sotolinga. Proverbs chapter 10 verse 17. Bible says whoever is disciplined shows the way of to, to, to life. Bible says but whoever ignores correction leads others astray. You want to pray with me this morning. My children will not lead others astray in the name of Jesus. My children will take it to discipline. The discipline that we give them as parents, they will take it to it. In the name of Jesus. My children and my grandchildren will listen to instruction they will follow instructions godly instructions in the name of jesus pray with me this morning my children and my grandchildren will, have, will not have any ungodly habits in the name of jesus they will not ignore correction pray with me by the power of god i come against every spirit of rebellion in the lives of my children and my grandchildren pray with me this morning in the name of jesus rasa tutaliga d is for discipline resha toliga do satutaliande rakabosha kukaliga no matter how young your children are you want them to be disciplined come on pray resa tolika do satutaliande 
Masha tutaliga dusa tutalianda rakaboso tolika dusa tutaliga resha tolinga mande bo shenteriande Proverbs chapter 13 verse 1 Bible says a wise son is his father's instruction but a mocker does not respond to rebukes you want to declare this morning that my children will not respond to mockers in the name of Jesus my children will respond to rebook in the name of Jesus my children and my grandchildren are disciplined in the name of Jesus they will respond to rebook, oh God, of their parents' instructions. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. Re Satolika, Rakabisha Kukaliga, Ratsatolika Sutaliande, Titus chapter 1, verse 8. Bible says, Rather, he must be hospitable, one who loves what is good, who is self controlled, who is disciplined, who is upright, who is holy and disciplined. This morning, pray that your children and your grandchildren will. We keep, oh God, we will we, we, we be kind hearted in the name of Jesus. My children and my grandchildren are hospitable, they are disciplined, they love what is right, they love what is good. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. Resa Kolika do Satutaliande, Rakabisha Kukaliga do Sakukaliande, Rakaboso Toliga, Retebosha Tutaliga. My children and my grandchildren will not despise discipline. In the name of Jesus, come and give him glory this morning exalt the name of God this morning thank him for the spirit of competence in the lives of my children and my grandchildren thank you Lord because my children have self-control they are disciplined in the name of Jesus they they yield to the disciplines of our of, 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 of their parents in the name of Jesus father we give you praise I exalt you this morning in Jesus mighty name we have prayed amen and amen thank you so much for joining me this morning this podcast is brought to you from prayer and liberation ministries i palm for godly counseling and prayers for relationships and for your children you can contact me on my email the email is dpmom at iprayerandliberation.site if you do not receive this podcast directly from me and you would love to we have a whatsapp group for the pray mom with pt please email me to get an invite link to this group the email again is dpmom at iprayerandliberation.site for more prayers for your children like this you can subscribe and follow us on our youtube channel now i palm ministry i would love to hear from you please send me your testimony send them to the email you can also connect with us on our instagram and on our facebook page on the handle the premium with pt if this podcast has been a blessing to you please share with someone god bless you and bye for now